Why? There we go. The question of the hour, he asks, why? Right, why would I ever do it? Well then, quite a crowd I've gathered, isn't it? Ah. Hello, friends. Surprise? No, no, no. No, that's better. I got sloppy, didn't I? Woo! <laughs> uh. Oh boy. <sighs> Should look at your car, Inspector. Right here. Have we heard anything from Piper yet? Piper's still quarantined. Right, right. Um, Desdemona's fate. Right, uh, the coloration blends in perfectly with her cure, honestly. So, um, hope she's alright. There's no point in anything now, is there? I've been had. Are you saying that uh, Piper has been poisoned? If she's had her cure for the evening, if she's drank her cure, then absolutely she has. Oh, it's all right. It's all right. The fate comes uh, self-inflicted, really. Are you innocent or guilty? Time will tell, won't it? Just say it. Just say it. Why would I say it? Then I have no case, really. <laughs> no. My hubris is beyond me. Yes, I uh, consider myself an artist, really. Yes, a master worker, if you will. Yes. I thought uh, maybe I had Hal framed. I was positive that Hal would go down for this, but um, <sighs> I got sloppy. I got cocky, really, indeed. I shouldn't say, should I? It's improper for a gentleman to tell, right? Rather improper. Do you want to look at you, gentlemen murdered? Are you murdered? Are you a gentleman? Well, here's the question. Yes? I've made the world a better place. Have you? Oh, indeed. In what way? Oh, by curing the world of its monsters. Oh. Now, Lily, I will say that's an unfortunate death. That is rather unfortunate. Yes, but there's much greater plans afoot here, so... Uh... How was Ben the monster? Ben! Yeah. Did you ever meet Ben? Yes, I did. Ben was harboring an army of uh, con men. People that steal, you, steal your gold from you in the evening. To, to lie to, directly to your face and to bankrupt this town so he could be the one with all the gold and all the power, right? That is what Ben was. That is what he did. Oh, yes, but kind of. But exactly is what he did. He wasn't trying to rob the town. He was trying to bring joy to the children. Sure. Thank you. Oh, Ophelia, Benjamin, nice to see you. I don't suppose you can't see me there, can you? It's unfortunate, isn't it? Tell him I said hello. Just a good thing we have our execution. You are? You're glad that I'm in this cage, though? Yeah, it's unfortunate for me. Why don't you go to Feral, Maxwell? Feral! Feral, and ran off into the woods. Oh, very good. Uh, my poison doesn't do that, no. There's plenty of opium in it to keep you calm while the belladonna lulls you to sleep. Yes. So if she's active enough to be feral and run into the woods, then she's just fine. Uh, would the poison that mimic the effects like a heart attack? Heart attack? Yes. Well, uh, belladonna is quite toxic, so if it gets into the bloodstream, that could very well be possible. But again, there is the um, acacia, I believe it's called, the mythosian plant, for adus ex exficiation and so It closes the airways, airways, excuse me. And um, of course, the opium is to uh, quiet them down a bit. And then there are added allergens, common allergens. So if, uh, if Piper was allergic to uh, nuts or to fish oil or to cinnamon, perhaps, then she would be uh, right proper asphyxiated before the uh, belladonna ever got to her. I was talking about somebody else. Did you ever open that box? I did. What's in a box? I, did, I didn't care. Oh, <laughs> I didn't care at all. You did it? No, no, he was dead and I knew that. I knew that all along. It was, it was good enough at that point? Oh, it was. It was indeed. Was it just closed then or was it papers? No, it was neither. It was files. It was something very damning for the judge, but I took my revenge proper in time. That's what I was asking you about. Oh, the heart attack, right? Yes, yes indeed. Desdemona's fate looks like a heart attack. 
Okay. Indeed, indeed. Yes, one so of my uh, masterpieces. Nimer, right, Naima, that was more of a uh, creme opportunity, if you will. He was wandering about, he had uh, sort of overshot Vela's, um, what's the word I'm looking for, uh, jurisdiction, right? She was the leader, but Naima is the one that kicked Hal out. And when he was wandering in the woods all by himself and attacked by a couple of dark blood, well, the rest was a bit of fire magic, wasn't it? You're just practicing? Indeed. What else do you want to confess to oh, while you're in a <laughs> right. Buddy, we Anything. <laughs> what do you want to know? Uh, when we Violet's asked, father. Why didn't you yes, talk? absolutely Violet's father. That was one, one of the most pleasurable ones, to be honest. <laughs> do you practice necromancy? Did you no. take Lily's voice? I would never. Not in a million years would I practice she necromancy. Said. said she can't speak, love. Yeah, How would you well, know she that? Can mouth and stuff. That she can't speak. Her voice. I'm lying to the last over here, aren't I? How do you know she can't speak if you didn't know she took her voice? Because I can see lying. her. And I'm lying. I've always been a right proper liar, that's why I'm an actor. Right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, the singing. Yes, that sort of a uh, summoning bit there, right? You see, as I sing more and more, I draw her power to ensure that I can't get sick. Right, as the, pl the plague is uh, frolicking about here and there, I figured I would um, protect my assets and ensure that I was safe. Are you infected then? Absolutely not. Okay. Can't be. Because of the necromancy. Precisely. Uh, so the bit about uh, the mind control potion, was that true or fake? Oh, that with me? Yes. That was true, actually. Yeah, that was real. Okay. That was real, yeah, yeah. Do you have current involvement with the one you Absolutely not, no. They are um, hacks, if you will. Yeah. Far too um, brash about what they believe in, you know. I've been doing this for, um, I don't know, six years, and this is the first time anyone's even questioned me about anything. So, uh, the fact that you even know that the OTG exists means they're doing it wrong. Yeah. That's what all your songs, your songs to, to, to rally power and strength around them. Are they songs of freedom? Freedom? The song that I sing? Yes. Well, sure. I think it's a fight song, really. It's it sort is of, a fight song. Yes, it rallies the troops, right? To fight against the evil that threatens us. Interesting. Indeed. Indeed. And of course, I'll, I'll, be, I'll go down in history as that evil that threatens us, of course. And let's see. Do we tip? As the evil Merryweather? We do. Watch your toes, love. There it is. There you go. <laughs> Yes, the evil Merryweather. Sure, sure, if you want to call me Mer Merryweather. I sort of started calling myself Maxwell when I started the killings, right? Oh. It's my first one right here. One trophy you didn't get from me, Inspector. Indeed, it will stay snugly on my pinky if it can. Not uh, your sister. This one? Yes. You think I killed my sister? You said the ring was from your sister. Right, from. right, no, no. Ah, um, I can't tell you all my secrets, can I? Well, you're just blabbing away right now. I figured sure. I'd try. Sure, well, I must save something for later, right? I'm a man of stories. A trial. <laughs> Darn. Inspector, is there going to be a trial? Keep it up and we'll see. Oh, very good. Very good. There shall then maybe be a trial. Maxwell. Oi! How do you feel about eyeballs? Eyeballs? Uh, the gross, I suppose. Why do you ask? Okay. Maxwell, I may have come late to the party here, but uh, why? Why? There we go! The question of the hour, he asks, why? Right, why would I ever do it? I was wrong. And I believe that I had the power to do what was right. My sister was stolen from me, taken from me by a corrupt man, right? He used all of his power, all the, the opportunity that he had to steal my life from me, everything. I gave up law, I gave up my sister, my best friend in the entire world. I watched as my parents fell into depression and did nothing but argue, nothing but bicker and fight. My father would get home from late night at the grocery store, right, watching the produce and such, and do nothing but complain. My mother would always complain about uh, her baked goods not selling quite as well as they should have. What I had to do, turn to the streets and um, pickpocket and such, right? Sleight of hand. Uh, comes in handy when you need to make a bit of gold, doesn't it? Right, so my ideal. All the individuals in this world that have power that they abuse, all the individuals that make this world a worse place with their existence, that they take all this high and might of theirs and they make others pay for it. They are the ones that must die. Why Ben? Oh, Ben was a con man. Right Ben, right, can't hear me. Right, he's, he's scowling at me though, isn't he? Yes. I would like to say something. Ben would like to say something. Oh, I know. <laughs>
can he can he hear me? Indeed. He can. He can. There's many things I want to say right now, Maxwell. Believe you me, there's many things I want to say right now. But I think I'll just say that I'm disappointed. Yes. You see, um, you know, I think I think there's a lot in common between the two of us, you know? Sure. Yeah. We, we were both liars, or I'll say it, you know, <laughs> never told the truth. The best either. of them, weren't we? Um, we were both, you know, we both came from difficult childhoods. Yes. Both didn't have the best circumstances, both found profit and success in lying and cheating. Yes, indeed. Deep down, Deep. all right? <laughs> Somewhere I'm inside. I'm a good person, right? <laughs> You're That's sure? That's the truth. That's yes. the truth. I, Somewhere. I was a con man. I was a liar. I had lots of regrets. But Maxwell, deep down, there's nothing good left in you. Ah, oh, yes. I've never been able to speak to a victim before. This is absolutely fascinating. Nothing good in me. Nothing good in me. Sure, sure. That's fair. Really, that's fair. I see how you see it that way. Yeah. A man who murders can't be a good man, right? No matter what his motivation is, he's dark and he's evil. There's no good that he brought. Right? Zamorax, tell me. You're always the first to come by and rename the troop. Why is that? Like the troop. Who founded the troop, ladies and gentlemen? I mean, Meriwether Morgan Milsom that founded the troop, wasn't it? Marvellous Maxwell. The marvellous, mustachioed man. Murderer of a man. Maxwell Morgan, indeed. Right? <laughs> Maxwell. I did some good in this world, I believe that. Necromancy could possibly bring your sister back. Well, I, I, now here, here's the, the common mistake that I see, is that individuals seek this power to bring people back from the dead or whatever have you, right? Why would I ever want my sister back in this world? That's the question, right? I'm out to rid the world of all of its evil and I see it everywhere. So, I see it all over the place, right? So why would I ever bring Marjorie back to that? I wouldn't want to. That is not your motivation. Of course not, no. No. You see, I play a much bigger game, a larger game that no one could even begin to fathom. Madam Mayor! Hello! So sorry about your father. That's tragic, really. Oh, I got it. Uh, it's quite sad. Did you say you did or did not kill that? Oh, I can't admit to anything. Oh, right. Did anybody remember? Did he admit to killing that? No, I'm just apologizing for your father. He said that it was probably the most uh, pleasurable. Ben? Yes. Goodbye, Ben. So long. Thank you so much for that. Oh, goodbye. For Working for someone. Just myself, love. Yes, just myself. An artist, a true, true artist, works alone, doesn't he? I would never want to share this glory with anyone else, right? Never. <laughs> Is this your twin? Yeah. Twin? No, no. Two years the younger. Excuse me. Yes. You have the play. No, I don't. Oh. Wait, would you like it? <laughs> no, I'm just counting who does. Oh, not who. Oh. No, no. Rather immune, I am, actually. What were your plans for Cecily? Oh, I love Cecily. In, in fact, um, oh, I believe my most... Uh, I never loved Brian, no. What was that, Mayor? Please speak up. Why? Why? Why does everyone else know that you killed my father? Oh, but I don't know that they know that, do they? They know it. I told you, didn't I? You did. Why? He's a bad man. He doesn't deserve to be murdered. No one deserves to be murdered, Maxwell. And that was what I disagree with you, unfortunately. You Why did he kill my sister? Did she deserve to be murdered? He wouldn't have done anything that he has done, but he still didn't deserve to be killed by the likes of you. The likes of me. Right. Little what makes Maxwell. you think you can take someone else's life? Balance. Peace. Yes! <laughs> you recognize this book? Not a clue. Not a clue? You've never seen this before? Never in my life. Okay. No idea what that is. Alright. Thank you very much. Of course. Oh, she left. So long, Madam Mayor! Maxwell Lilly was yes. not guilty of any crime. No, that one was tragic, really, unfortunately. I need my trophies. <laughs> Only way that the necromancy works. But with 
the nature of Benjamin's death is that, um, well, I couldn't exactly pick anything up the body. I was arrested by a fine inspector, wasn't I? Yes, indeed, a good man who's brilliant at his job. So I just sneak back over there, right, and take something for myself. Lily Dunghill was a witness of that, wasn't she? So that was rather unfortunate. What's he doing to Ollie? Oliver. Yeah. He's not at all involved. Uh, why are his senses suddenly sparked? The more necromancy you do... Now that is interesting. Yes. I have no idea. I have not a clue. Honestly, I don't think it's related it's in the slightest. Okay. No. No, not really, because uh, necromancy, it's not going to heighten your senses. That's for sure, yeah. isn't it? So no, I think it's an entirely different case. Okay. Ro, why am I still in these? I'm locked away, aren't I? You deserve it. Deserve it. I do, don't I? Like a monster of a man. Maxwell Morgan, the marvellously mystic monster murder of a man. Brilliant. Brilliant. Maxwell, if it comes down to it, yes. would rather be executioned or in prison for life? Uh, I think there are bigger plans for me. I think we can just end it, can't we? My run's come to an end. Either I spend my life behind bars or I am. Um, we just end it right here, right now, or. Uh, when I go to York, I suppose. There's not a proper judge here that can really actually uh, issue an execution. So I suppose York ought to be the place for me. But we'll see what they say. Right? I can have big plans for either, really. Big plans. Well. Did you work alone or did you have accomplices? All by myself, luckily. A great artist doesn't need co artists, ghost writers, or anything of that sort. And honestly, Working with others puts you in more danger, doesn't it? Right, doesn't it? If you work with others, right, they can also be caught. Maximises your risk. Just me means that I, uh, what was it, six years, I've gotten away from this bar. So, um, never work with partners. It's great rubbish. You lot, you're giving him what he wants. Go away. Ah, don't take the fun away, Ophelia, please. Yeah. I love a crowd. Please. I really do Ollie, love a crowd. Fun in groups, so were there more that helped you? No, 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 no. It's that uh, you don't want to trust a group, right? You don't need ghostwriters if you're a true artist, right? And so what you did with art? Of course it was. Of a sort. How so? Well, but what is the purpose of art, love? Let's, let's talk about that. What's the purpose of art? Oh, you're asking this question. Of course I am. Oh, wow. It's not rhetorical. Uh, of course. How to light the world. <laughs> To make it a better place, right? That's precisely what I did. Why? What, what, did, what, what did the people do that you killed? Well, which one do you want to hear about? Lily. There were There were 17. Oh. Lily, that one was unfortunate. That one was unfortunate. Yes, Lily, uh, sad. But really, she just she saw me sneaking away with what I wanted. She she knew, the information she knew could take me down, could, uh, could kill me, could hang me, really. So, of course, I had to, uh, I don't know. Ah. <laughs> Take her down, the only way that I knew how. And that one was panicked. That one really was my undoing, wasn't it? it was, she was the only female. Really? Isn't that a fun fact? Yes, indeed. My only males. Ah, they are the ones that truly deserve to be taken down a peg in this world. <laughs> really, they do. They do. Maybe it was that I was wronged by a male. Maybe it was because um, the uh, Honourable Judge Atkinson was a man. <coughs> and I just couldn't get that uh, visage out of my head. Perhaps that was it. Maxwell, if Ben, why not Rooster? He said as much a comment. You see, Rooster had actually, um, he had sort of seen the error of his ways. He had backed away and sort of uh, began to change his life. Benjamin was continuing to take and to take and to well, take. Why and not give people the opportunity to change like Rooster did? I believe that once you're given enough opportunities, uh, once you start to take too much, you deserve to be well, rid of this world. And he was taking something that was far too special to me to be. Um, what was far too special? Ophelia. Far too special. Why is she so special? There's always been something about Ophelia that I can't shake. Something in the back of my mind. Maybe it's the reason we bicker so much. <laughs> but I don't know. She's mine. Um, that's true, they're, they're not, they're not. I'd like to believe that I'm hers as well, in a theoretical sense. I don't know if she feels the same anymore. I know she doesn't, I know she doesn't. Hey. Is she behind me? Uh, no, just us. Oh, no, dear. Oh, just okay. us. Hello there. Yes. Wondering if you're innocent, what's the point of all this charade? 
What's the point of all the charade? Yes. If I'm innocent? Yes. Well, <clears throat> that's a long answer, isn't it? Mm. If I'm innocent, then I suppose I'd be working in a group at that point, which would then make me guilty by association. And at this point, I'd be covering for somebody so that they don't uh, get taken down. Mm. Right? Oh, excuse me. Mm. Worked up, aren't I? I see. Well, Maxwell, I'm disappointed. Aren't we all? With eyes open. Aren't we all? It's all right. Soon you'll see what it was all for. Soon you'll see that everything will come to fruition. Excuse me? You'll see. A twist. Can you tell me why? Sure, a twist. I do love a story, don't I? A twist ending. Ah. Was, it, was it ever him? Was he innocent all along? Right, where have you? A twist ending. Or was he right? Was he always right? I guess we'll find out. Won't we? we will. We will. And thank you so much for allowing me to lead the vigil. Thank you so much. It was a perfect cover. Uh, you know, until now. <laughs> you did a good job that evening. Uh, i give you that. Thank you. Thank you. It was a pleasure, really. It is a little morbid, though, that you would lead the of course. vigil for the person that you murdered. And Paul Bear for both of them. I did carry their yeah. caskets to the grave. It was good cover, really. It was really good cover. And people believed it for a long time, and then suddenly Piper had to come forward with her song, didn't she? Had to come forward with her song. Ah, yes, when I was a young lad, my father, he told me. Yes, a brilliant song. Yes. Proud of it, really. Have you been playing me? Playing you? I wouldn't get to. Play. I don't know what you mean. Um. Playing you how? Blind to you? No, how? About all of everything. To oh, right. What you asked me? You know, I didn't kill anyone. Exactly. Oh, I was lying. <laughs> I was lying all along, wasn't I? Yes, it was a lie. I played you. I'm going to be better people. Well. Yeah. 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 It's not working out so well. Unfortunately, I find that my morality, my uh, betterment, well, it was, um, it wasn't worth the sacrifices I had to make. Unfortunately. Now, what I am right sad about is Cecily. What's his name? Mine! Yeah. Maxwell! Yeah. Maxwell Morgan at your service. I suppose not anymore. <laughs> Probably restraint. I love Cecily. That is the truth, 100%. That is true, 100% that's true. She doesn't deserve the likes of me. Yes, I plan to propose, actually. But um, when I think about Cecily, when I think about the life we could have together, I never once have regretted what I've done. When I look her in her eyes, I wish I could take all of it back. Every Hungry, Maxwell? Yes, what was that? Hungry. Oh, yes. Thank you. Oh, uh, half eaten. <laughs> right, proper. Thank you. I think the real trick is that you don't have hands to eat. That is the real trick. It is coated in my uh, concoction. Oh, very good. Your hands cold. A bit, yeah. Oh. That's right, proper, isn't it? Right, let's try here. Aha. Oh, no. Slight of hand, my specialty, not slight of feet. Speaking of... What? It's a big decision they have to make, really. We need to be eating. You're the one who's shown me evermore. Right. Yes. Indeed. Chauncey. Hi, Lan. We're going to find the real evidence. It could have been anyone. Suds has poisoned before. Septis. Right. A killer who escaped justice before has just returned to town. We're going to find the real. <coughs> John, see, I care about you too much. Stop looking. What are you talking about? Don't waste We're going to get time. you out of there. I shouldn't be released from here. I shouldn't. Yeah. No, no. This Why are you is where taking the fall for someone? Right, yes. Uh, the, the person I'm taking the fall for would be named Meriwether. 
Yes, I believe Merriweather is the one that originally got me into this mess, to be completely honest. Merriweather. Indeed. Unfortunate, isn't it? I wish you would know. Another man named Merriweather. <laughs> sort of, but not entirely. No, no. Before the moustache, before the name change, before any of it. That's when it truly began. The true plight, right? The true killings really began with a man named Merrick. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Don't waste your time. You have much bigger things to do. Much better things to do. You luckily have escaped without any uh, sort of, uh, you know, job on your hands. So. Escaped? You, yeah. You escaped yeah. life, at least. You've escaped this whole bit, right? This mortal coil. You don't have to uh, do what I did. What on earth are you talking about? This isn't... This isn't the man who I've been... running around England with for the last five years! Right. Um, I've been playing a character. Have you believed it? You're playing a character now. Yes, Maxwell Morgan is his name. What sort of sick joke is this, Maxwell? Fortunately, Chauncey, it's not a joke. Oh. Yeah. I went method with it, really. Sort of dove entirely into the uh, madness. You're being serious. I'm being serious. Speak up for everyone can hear you. I'm being serious. That's what I'm doing. You're saying that everything we've been through since London, all of that was a lie. Not all of it. Um, not all of it. Is that better, Kyra? Better. Not everything. No. What was true then? What was true was my passion. What was true were my feelings for you and the rest of the group. I promise you that. I love and care for every one of you and consider you my family. No, you bloody don't. I no have... one who cares for someone like that would ever do something like you have done. Right. And that is what I figured you'd say. So I kept it a secret. I kept it quiet. It was a lone operative. But, um, what do you mean you cared about us, but you went about business? This evil business of yours! I don't want to raise my voice as well, Chanty, but I was making the world a better place for you. What? For you. For the rest of the troop, really, for everyone. For, for killing Lily? That one was unfortunate, I'll be completely honest. But I, my work wasn't finished. What work? What is this work you were talking about? What are you talking right, about, Maxwell? Right, I understand why you'd be confused about that. That is uh, understandable. Um, the work. Where do we begin with the work, do we? There's a lot of power to be gained. And with this power, there are high costs. And there's only a few ways to pay those costs. Dark. What happened for the love of the art? For oh. bringing smiles to people's yes. faces! That's why I did it! Joy, That's why I did it, Chauncey! That's why I did it! For the joy! To bring smiles to people's faces! To whose faces? Everyone! To save the sister that I couldn't save! Alright? To save the loved ones from the tyranny that this world breeds! That's who it was for. Your sister? Yes. You think she would have wanted you to do these things? Well, I suppose it's unfortunate that I never could have asked. Didn't have the opportunity, did I? No, no, she was taken from me. Stolen. So I stopped thieves. That is what I did. None of this, none of this could bring her back. No. She would be ashamed of you, Maxwell. Or Merriweather. Sure. Whatever your stupid name is. I like Maxwell better. Rot in hell, Maxwell. If I believed in anything like that, I imagine that's where I'd go, yeah. Oh. I've 
brought the beast out of you. That's the emotion I've been looking for this entire time, friend. Bring that into your performances and you'll be brilliant. <laughs> Run in hell, you monster! <sighs> the unfortunate fallout of such a crime. Dark magic requires a known sacrifice. Yes, it does. That is the power that you were talking about, isn't it? Yes. Wouldn't you much rather know the sacrifice than just to guess? Yes, I guess I would. I think that the words dark and light are uh, misattributed, I suppose. Um, because... I would much rather know what I'm sacrificing than to um, guess or allow the fates to take it over, if you will. That feels much more irresponsible to me. So what schools of magic are you, um, do you know? Evocation, with the fire, right, I know that one. Um, illusion, right, the school of charms. I don't know what the proper name for that one is, but... Uh, uh, charms? Indeed. Enchantment. Enchantment, that's the one, yes. I really specialise in charms. I had you fooled for a while, didn't I? Thanks to Charles. So you did it? <laughs> That's still um, to be seen. Did I do it, Inspector? I think if the Sherrod had anything to say about it, you absolutely did, but... Um... Honestly? I don't care whether you did or do. Did or didn't. You stole some... You, you got with his voice. Honestly, if I see that returned, that would be enough. I do have Lily's voice, that is true. He's, he's not wrong about that. But the real question is, if you were to commit some, such a crime, what would you gain out of it? So much. So much! The power of souls, the power of individuals, right? The power of the dead. Indeed. Necromancy has quite a um, poignant punch to it, really. So just a bit... Um, a bit deeper, a bit further, and I really could have had something on my hands. Real power. What would an actor want in necromancy? I'm much more than an actor, friend. Much more. I'm a man. And man, I find, is the scariest thing of all. <laughs> right? So why are you in the cage? I'm sure someone's already asked you. Oh, right. Um, it is believed that I'm sort of a pattern killer, right? A With, um, pattern killer? Yes, 17... No, no. Piper didn't work. 16 sort of um, different, what do you say, unfortunate events under my belt. I see. It's what's believed anyway, right? And who did you kill? Well, the question is if I killed anyone at all. Oh, right. Right, right. Um, do you want all 16 by name? I, I don't know. <laughs> yes. Just the most recent then, yes? Naima, the Elven Ranger. Uh, Benjamin Scuff and Lily Dunghill with an attempt on Piper Monroe, but that one failed. Fortunately, actually, I'm very glad that one failed. Oh, Benjamin Scuff. But is he st he's dead then. Right, that was dead as a git. Oh. I will say that I was very surprised when his ghost returned. <laughs> that was maddening, wasn't it? Right, and then Lily came back, and that was even more maddening. I will say that in all of the time that I allegedly have been practicing, I've never seen a ghost return before. And that really was where the cog was uh, jammed in the machine. That's I necromancy. That's necromancy for you. What was that? How'd you kill him? Allegedly asphyxiation. Is allegedly the cause, right? Yes, strangulation from uh, Miss Lily Donghill, and then uh, Desdemona's fate is what it's called, and it's a sort of poison that involves uh, heavy toxicity along with a sort of um, a, a mythogen plant agent that uh, will close the throat and asphyxiate you from the inside. Allegedly, of course. Well, apparently it doesn't succeed for you to get rid of them, if allegedly you did so, because they come back as ghosts. And that is where I was surprised, to be completely honest. But doesn't it feel like it's kind of a waste of time to kill them if they come back? This is the first time it's happened. Oh. Allegedly. How do you plan to escape? Escape here? Yeah. Uh, I suppose by either sword or by hanging. Oh. I think uh, Benjamin was calculated. I think he needed a uh, sacrifice for the Allegedly. power that he was seeking in dark magic. It requires a known sacrifice. That is the question. Lily was, Who um, else were the bigger suspects? 
Hausen Halle for Nelson Rion, whatever how you say his name. So Hal for short. Right, Hal for short. Or um let's see Orin, right, the uh, captain of the ship, captain, as you call him, I can't salute proper and the time, unfortunately. Yes, him could have done it as well. Um chance he have a fourth, but he did not do it, so don't question him. I was nervous he was going to go away for this in the first place, and that would have been right improper, wouldn't it have been Ozymandias? Yes. I would like to know what evidence you have against this man. Yes, Ozzy, present the evidence. Yes, Ozzy. Are you his counselor? Um, I could be. That's true. Look, my, um, my best you course of action... <laughs> no, that's not going to work at all. That's, that's far too ridiculous. You see, my best course of action... Or is it just ridiculous enough to work? You don't know. Oh, I say Lauren Cambridge. So, a lesser university then? Um, um, well, if you were an actual person, you would see them right here. Clearly, you're not. Mm -hmm. um, my best course of action I, I is to um, <laughs> remain silent, of course. That's the goal here. Good on you, good on you, not giving any What was that? Away. <laughs> what was that you said? After your time. Oh, sure, sure. So, why did you have a legend? Why did you have a legend? Balance. <laughs> There's no judge here, they can't order that here. It'd be illegal. Whoever whoever did it would also be executed. Also, that's rather inhumane. There's something deeper going on here. Something deeper? What do you mean by that? Well, I think Ben was the calculated move. The Absolutely sacrifice was. that you needed to gain the power in the dark arts that you needed. Allegedly. Allegedly. Yes. If, oh no. Allegedly. Allegedly. Why on earth would you throw away your life, your betrothed? It's a sad one. Your love? Oh, my, my love. Yes. Not betrothed yet, unfortunately. Why would you? Why would you commit this crime if you had the risk of losing her? <laughs> because there are larger games at play than just my life. My love and my feelings, well, they aren't important in the grander scheme of things. What is your grander scheme? Ah, wouldn't you like to know? I've said too much already, haven't I? You said too much. Or do you send that? Hello! How are you? Oh, you said God. Oh, yeah. It's a pleasure. Death is only the beginning, then, isn't it? Good choice. Really, it's amazing. I, I couldn't have gotten this far. How old are you? I am 22 years of age. Why are you in here? <laughs> Why am I in here? Crimes. Crimes. Murder. Allegedly, of course. More murders and more murders. What was that? I heard you confessed. I might have an accident. Um, are you his? Are you his legal counsel there, sir? Oh, excuse uh, me. You're being asked a question. You want to be arrested? Oh, are you his legal counsel? Oh, um, well, I, I, um, without, uh, his, without him choosing legal representation, I am his uh, state appointed attorney. Credential state appointed. Um, what does that mean? Oh, hold on. Why did you? Well, you know, you're in this state right now. Why did I allegedly um, what? You're not doing so well. The Barry, my stamp of uh, approval, um, Power. it may be my master finger, but uh, it, uh, it, yes. is, it is a royal stamp. Lily, unfortunately, was the witness. Right, she just saw what I was doing. If you'd like to ask him a question, you can stand in line with the rest. Well, he was a con man, and uh, he was rather charming, wasn't he? He was trying to take things that uh, didn't belong to him. Ophelia Blanche. 
come around to you. No, 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 she was simply family. She was family to me. Right, make her leave the acting troupe and uh, go off on her own. And that wouldn't be proper, she was too talented. You killed him. Allegedly. You allegedly killed him, and Lily caught you, so you killed her too. You are a brilliant detective, aren't you? Very good. Very good. Allegedly, that is what happened. Allegedly. Allegedly. Yes. The Piper seems to be doing all right. Thank Very you good. Oh. Woo. That was a close one. No need to. Hi. Hello. 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 Are you? Hi. What should I say? Thought, did you drink your cure? Oh, your medicine. You did? How much? Get a new sight. How you feel? You're tired. How's your breathing? Very good, you're all right. The opium would kick in already. The alleged opium. A big, big, large part of the medicine that you drink. Yes. What have you done? A lot. Where'd you get this I was in uh, Romeo and Juliet once with Mercutio. They said that you killed him. Oh, that bit. Right. Um, but I don't believe you. Yeah, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, Over this side. Go back to quarantine, love. How are you feeling? Have things gone my way, Piper? You've been cured of this already. What do you mean, your way? My way. Unfortunately, many lives have been sacrificed in order for my way to work, right? So it can't work my way, but it could happen. Sort of. I play a character named Matthew Morgan. But I do like his name quite better. He's a lover, really. He's a passionate man, great actor. Nice moustache. Great moustache. I'm afraid that. <laughs> It's all right, it's all right, but calm down. When he was a young lad, my father, he told me to raise up my sword and to fight against me. I knew that would get here to leave, that's good news. Didn't want her to go any more mad than she already had, right? Hypothetically, how does the necromancy involve your sister? Oh, it doesn't. Not at all, not whatsoever. No, not one bit. You don't want to talk to her, commune with her? No, I think she belongs on uh, the other side or whatever you believe in. She's gone. And that's enough. So then the necromancy is just for yourself? Then. It's for all of us. It's for everyone. For everyone. Indeed. So, the necromancy that you perform can prolong my life as well? Sure, if you'd like it to. Are you saying that uh, that can be what makes us all immune? 
Right, that's how I'm a new friend. Yes, but you're the one also performing the acts that are the uh, calculated sacrifice. Right, all we need to do is tie you to a trophy, right? My favourite trophies that I have. Mm -hmm. Such as the stopwatch in my pocket, right? The ring on my finger and the bag of tricks I gave to Ozymandias over there, right? That what you need is a trophy, a token, right? That you are tied to, that you can draw on the power of these uh, deceased, right? Mm -hmm. Then you can become immune. Not invincible. Just immune to other sorts of things, things specifically that you ask about, right? So if you want to be immune to the disease, like I did, right, then you can, of course, be immune to the disease. Mm, interesting. Makes sense. Doesn't it? Oh, I'm exhausted. So if you wouldn't want your sister back in this cruel world, why do you want to prolong your life in this cruel world? Prolong my life? No, no. I just don't want to get sick. Ah, is the main thing, right? I am in the uh, ripe young age of 22, right? There's no There's use to prolong my life yet. There's a difference between wanting to end your life and wanting the pain to stop. Precisely. Yes. Right, and for the brief moment at the, at the current stage, right, all I really wanted was to, um, to stay alive, right? Mm. Yes. I didn't want any outside forces sort of, um, well, messing with what I had planned. Mm. But, uh, you know... Death comes to us all. Memento mori, right? So what do you have planned for the rest of your life? Well, I suppose it's going to be very short. Presuming that you get out of this somehow. Right, oh no. I don't know if I need to. Why did you kill your sister? I mean, that person. Oh yes, I did not kill my sister, no. Uh, that person was a witness to things that she shouldn't have seen, unfortunately. Unfortunately. Angry, I can tell. <laughs> can we help you get out? <laughs> no, no, you don't want to get yourself indicted either, right? It's rather dangerous business to break out a criminal, so um, you are very, very young and the world has big plans for you, so um, you should keep your nose out of trouble. You can do some good things. I am quite young, this is true. This is true. But I'm afraid that in my youth, Miles Magic, how old are you? Eleven. When I was about your age, right, I'm afraid that the world had slighted me already. The world had uh, hurt me in a way that could have been. Here I am, double your age. Thank you. Except for the. Troublesome business, isn't it? I don't say don't get into it. Steer clear of that one. Any crime is really. No, you should do. Become a lawyer. That's what I was going to do, is become a lawyer, right? You should become a lawyer and stop people like me. Yeah? Well, that would be proper, I think. I think you'd be good at it. You're charming, I can tell you. How did, how did you kill... Uh, Lily? Or Ben? Or Naima? Which one? Lily? Lily, that one was unfortunate. Uh, strangulation. What about Ben? A poison. Fire. I should have a black If your wife forgets your birthday, then you're legally allowed to stay with you. That'd be it. Maxwell, Matt, were you charmed in full form or in any way coerced into making said confession? Confession, I'm not talking about. Exactly! And, uh, so, uh, <coughs> me. Ah, sure, sorry about that. Ah. <laughs> Um, so yes, I, I was wondering uh, how I might be of legal aid to you, sir. Legal aid? Yes, yes. Well, <laughs> with the inspector right there, he's going to ask for your paper. Oh, yeah, uh, I've shown him my seal. Yes. Is he proper? He's a real best I can't say anything to you, unfortunately. Oh, all right, all right. What, uh, what can you Here's say? Here's the question, though. Right. Here's the question. Right. Visitation for me, right? Yeah, sure, all right. You're a friend of Mortimer's. Oh, yeah, yeah, mate. Very good, very good. Yeah, what can I say to you? Oh, he, he sent me uh, to tell you that he sent me. You can return to Mortimer and yeah. say that um, I thank him 
Yeah. All of his words. Thank you for all the words over the years. Ah, no problem. Brilliant. Thank you, thank you. Thanks, Good luck. Come down here to shout at you, but I don't think this is You can if you like. Would it make you feel better? No. Then don't do it. That was a power move right there. That was a good one. That hurt me, I'll tell you that. Bishop, how are you? Good. I don't know about that. No, but I feel a load lifted from my shoulders.